Welcome, I'm Jacob Heiser and today I will be teaching you how to print with TPU, which is like NinjaFlex on a Hyrule 3D machine. First I'm going to demonstrate the correct slicer recipe settings so your G-code is properly optimized to print TPU. There are a few main settings that are very important to have correctly adjusted. If your settings are wrong, it could cause a head to jam up with filament. For starters, we're going to make sure that the layer thickness is about 200 microns. We're going to ensure the print speed is 10 millimeters per second. You need to take it slow with a material like TPU or else too much material will end up being forced through the head at one time. TPU can be printed at temperatures between 215 and 250 degrees Celsius. Since I'm printing at a low speed, 215 degrees should be appropriate. The bed temperature should be around 50 degrees Celsius. If it's too low, the print won't adhere to the print bed. Import your STL file, in this case a PCB cover for high rail heads. Position the part and slice the file. Now we can export the G-code. Now that I'm at the printer, I can switch to an FH2260 head. Load your G-code and after the machine is heated up, we can print. Remember to program the head and bed to the right temperature. Here is the finished part. Thank you for watching this tutorial. And for more information, visit HyRel3D.com.